Hey guys, sorry if you're seeing me as a different color, it's because I'm using a webcam emulator to be able to use two webcams. The tutorial I'm doing today is actually just an application show. The application I'm going to be showing is called Gawker. It allows you to make time-lapse videos using a webcam. Your image stream, or you can also stream images, um, so other Gawker users can use your image stream. There I am, it's kind of frozen. Or, let's show my desktop. Yeah, okay. There's my desktop. You see, oh, that's cool. <laughs> okay, so it allows you to make time lapse movies. If you click the more option on your camera, go schedule, you can set a start time and a stop sign, and you can also share your image stream, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, click record, and that will allow us to set our frames per second, our uh, delay, and everything like that. We'll call it test. That'll go to the desktop, test one, actually. Okay, we're gonna capture frame at once every three, let's go once every three seconds. Yeah, once every three seconds and play it back at 25 frames per second. Now the formula to find out actually how much real lifetime passes by in one second of the video, um, it would be how many minutes of real life pass by in one second of the video is you take your frames per second, or sorry, you take your delay and you times it by the frames per second and you divide it by 60. So 3 times 25 divided by 60. 3 times 25 divided by 60. So 1.25 minutes of real life will pass by in one second of this video. Okay, and we'll click show time on frames which allows us to show the time record and I'll come back in I don't know three four minutes okay be right back all right and we're back so uh, what you actually just have to do I did it subconsciously is click the word stop here and um, automatically uh, it will create the time lapse to your desktop so it's I called mine test one let's play that I watched a YouTube video and everything, so it's a full-on time-lapse, and you can see um, the time go by in the bottom. So if you set it for, obviously, better frames per second, um, it, it will go better, but pretty sweet. And uh, remember that the quality, how crappy it is, that's only because I'm recording my desktop and my it's a big monitor. The quality on it is absolutely amazing. Here's the actual time-lapse of real life. See, it's very clear. You can see day pass by, the, the sun. Where's the sun? There's the sun passing by. Looks great. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, this application is free. It's called Gawker. Go Google it and download it. It's only for Mac. So, ha. Okay, talk to you later. Bye. Wow, sound like I'm ending a phone call.